You were just elected in a special election, and if you win here in 17 days, you'll come back to Washington and have perhaps your first chance to vote on yet another spending bill. So will you support more spending, or would you oppose it, actually? Well, it depends. It depends if, on if we're talking about infrastructure and brick-and-mortar projects, and certainly Alaska is a very young state. Um, Congressman Young, the late Young, um, my predecessor, had always been a very strong proponent and advocate for infrastructure. We need deep sea ports on the western coast of Alaska. We need military installations that we had never considered because, you know, you just had the clip about the the southern border. We're very worried about our most western border along the Bering Sea. We've had uh, folks from Russia come across already. There were two gentlemen who were trying to evade their inscription. And we certainly need to be investing as much as we possibly can in terms of military and, and other ways in Arctic infrastructure. A few weeks ago, about a month ago, the Coast Guard Admiral of, the, of Alaska informed us that off the coast of Alaska in, in, in U.S. waters or very close to U.S. waters off of the Aleutian chain, we have seen Russian and Chinese ships in formation practicing right off our shoreline or even within our waters. And there was some um, preliminary communication with them, not really much dialogue, and then the ships turned around. But that is a clear indication that we are in their crosshairs in the Arctic.